who told y'all this wasn't my real hair? Y'all didn't know that I was mixed with yakky. <laughs> yeah, girl, I'm mixed with that yakky, girl. Them, them, you see them waves, them curls? Don't, don't be fooled. Let's get into this, though. Sugar Boo, welcome back to another tutorial here on my channel. I am Shate and this is Putting Up With The Pop Pods. And in this tutorial, I am doing this sleek ponytail. But before we go any further, if you are new to our channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button located right down below this video. If you are a returning subscriber, hey, bestie, hey, mama, hey, friend, hope you are being blessed and safe as always. So we're gonna go ahead and jump straight into it. All right, so we're starting this style with an old blowout that I did on myself a couple of days ago. It's almost time for wash day, so I decided to do this curly ponytail just to subside for the next couple of days. So if you want to check out the full video on how I blow out my hair, that video will be at the top right hand of this corner. You can click on that. So let's get into the supply list. You're gonna need a wax stick, one bundle of hair, some spritz spray, some got to be spray, some hair glue, and some styling strips. Yes, ma'am, go ahead and take that list to the beauty supply store with you. All right, so I purchased this inexpensive pack of hair. It was $30 for three bundles, but like I said, we only need one. But I mean, who can deny $30 for three bundles of hair? So I went ahead and, and just took it. I mean, I mean, why not? I'm pretty sure I'll find something else to do with the other two bundles anyway. So I went in using the longest length in that pack, which was 18 inches. I went ahead and sectioned my hair into three sections. I did two in the front and then my one in the back. I wanted a low a low hanging ponytail you know so you know they had that 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 hang time just given given all that it needs so i go in first with my wax strip i then layer it with my spritz spray i use my blow dryer to warm up that wax because it gets it nice and soft and then when it hardens that hair stays in place honey it ain't going nowhere and did i mention i'm doing this entire style with no gel y'all didn't see that supply list say gel did you no it sure didn't mm -mm. Let's also talk about the shine that that wax stick is serving, okay? And the spritz spray on top of it just was giving me all of the 90s salon, hair salon, sitting up in there for five hours to get a press and curl. Okay, y'all remember them days? We need to bring them days back. I kind of miss them days. But anyways, let's get into this DIY ponytail real quick. So after I layer this all down, I am taking my time because I don't want not a hair to be out of place, okay? The blow dryer was making sure that everything was going to be dried and laid that fried dyed and laid to the side honey that is exactly what we doing here Now, I originally purchased this wax stick for my frontals. Um, I saw a lady on TikTok use it to lay down her frontal edges or, or whatever. Um, something that I'm not great at, but I purchased the product anyway because she swore by it. Now, I will say that it did all right on the lace frontal, but it is doing even better on my hair, okay? And then it smelled good. I forgot what, I think it's like a grape or something. Either way, I purchased that one from my local beauty supply store too. So I'm pulling everything back now that we've got everything laid laid down i did have a few issues because my hair is still kind of short so on the sides where um yeah it, it was coming apart a little bit but that's okay we just pulled out that spritz spray and, and and gelled it right and laid it right on down okay now i'm taking my styling strip i pulled my baby here in the back y'all it kind of pissed me off and i'm uh, wrapping that around my edges and then i'm going to braid my ponytail down and i'm a rubber band it at the ends and then we'll take another styling strip and wrap that braid up okay now I didn't really know how to secure the strip to my ponytail so I just rubber band it because I figured it's all gonna be glow glued down anyway it, it wouldn't make much of a difference I don't know if there's another way of doing it but that's what I did and it worked just fine for me Now let's get out that 18 inches of yakky, crinkle, curly hair that we got from the beauty supply store. And I'm taking my handy dandy hair glue and I applied the glue to the my ponytail, not to my hair, 
but to the ponytail. So you see me there, I'm kind of like trying to smear it on there because I put a little bit too much. Um, but we're going to ignore that part. So now I'm taking the track and I'm trying to lay it around. And then, you you know, you're just going to wrap your ponytail. It's, it's very simple in theory in theory because let me tell you my arms my trap muscles my biceps all that was burning trying to get this mess to to wrap around a ponytail now the glue does dry fairly you know fast it doesn't take too long and if it does take too long just zap it with your blow dryer and you'll be good to go you can just keep on wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and that's just all i'm doing i'm trying to fit this entire bundle onto here maybe if i had somebody back there helping me and then i ain't got no eyes back there so i'm trying to help y'all see what i'm doing but i can't can't even see what I'm doing so you know this is the best I got for you Now, once I got towards the end of the bundle, it did get a lot easier because I was able to manage it a little better. Um, they started tangling into each other because the, the track was just so long um, and I didn't want to cut it to, to just reapply it. I just felt like that was just going to be even more of a hassle. So just take your time. Just take your time, honey. So once I get to the very end, I start gluing down the, putting glue on the track versus the ponytail. And I'm just wrapping that around my hair. Um, I'm pretty sure at this point I have gotten hair glue onto my hair, but that's okay. I know how to get hair glue out of my hair, but if you you are not comfortable with hair glue on your hair, I don't recommend you doing this by yourself. Now I'm taking a small strip of the hair and I'm wrapping it around the base of the ponytail. And this is supposed to be like the scrunchie or the hair tie for the hair. So it looks all nice and seamless. Um, I apply a little bit of got to be spray to it, hold it down and zap it with my blow dryer real quick. Um, and there you see it, there it is right there. And then I take another styling strip and I wrap it around the back side of my hair this time because I, I told y'all them little small pieces back there, they, they was trying to stick out. Um, and that's pretty much it. All right, guys, so this is a completed look, the, the finished result, and Lord, this thing was tiring, okay? Yeah, this this was a, definitely a challenge, mainly because I'm working, like, literally in the back of my head, so trying to do this, style in the back of my head, and I just ain't, I, I haven't worked up my trap muscles yet from doing my hair enough, so it was definitely, <laughs> definitely a challenge, but I think I would try it again. Um, I definitely think I'll just probably go the, the easier route and just get a synthetic ponytail, honey, because my gosh, the only easy thing about this entire style was putting my own hair into a ponytail. Like that, that was it. <laughs> so thank you guys for joining us on another tutorial. Do not forget to participate in our 25 days of giveaways. We are in the midst of it and it is almost over. I can't believe that I've really been keeping up with 25 days of videos, like a straight 25 days of uploads. I have literally been working myself into the ground. It's just exhausting. <laughs> but um, it's just a way to say thank you to our 5,000 subscribers. We can't wait for another wonderful and great year next year, which is like two weeks away, y'all. 2022 is two weeks away. So thank you guys for joining us. We will see y'all on another one. Be blessed and be safe.